Lamentations chapter 4. How is the gold become dim? How is the most pure gold changed? The stones of the sanctuary are poured out at the head of every street. The precious sons of Eon, comparable to fine gold, how are they esteemed as earthen pitchers, the work of the hands of the potter? Even the jackals draw out the breast. They give suck to their young ones. The daughter of my people is become cruel, like the ostriches in the wilderness. The tongue of the sucking child cleaveth to the roof of his mouth for thirst. The young children ask bread, and no man breaketh it to them. They that did feed delicately are desolate in the streets. They that were brought up in scarlet embrace dunghills. For the iniquity of the daughter of my people is greater than the sin of Sodom, that was overthrown as in a moment, and no hands were laid upon her. Her nobles were purer than snow, they were whiter than milk, they were more ruddy in body than rubies, their polishing was as of sapphire. Their visage is blacker than a coal, they are not known in the streets, their skin cleaveth to their bones, it is withered, it is become like a stick. They that are slain with the sword are better than they that are slain with hunger, for these pine away, stricken through, for lack of the fruits of the field. The hands of the pitiful women have boiled their own children. They were their food in the destruction of the daughter of my people. Yahweh hath accomplished his wrath, he hath poured out his fierce anger, and he hath kindled a fire in Theon, which hath devoured the foundations thereof. The kings of the earth believed not, neither all the inhabitants of the world, that the adversary and the enemy would enter into the gates of Yerushalem. It is because of the sins of her prophets and the iniquities of her priests that have shed the blood of the just in the midst of her. They wander as blind men in the streets. They are polluted with blood so that men cannot touch their garments. Depart ye, they cried to them. Unclean, depart, depart. Touch not! When they fled away and wandered, men said among the nations, They shall no more sojourn here. The anger of Yahweh hath scattered them. He will no more regard them. They respected not the persons of the priests. They favoured not the elders. Our eyes do yet fail in looking for our vain help. In our watching we have watched for a nation that could not save. They hunt our steps so that we cannot go in our streets. Our end is near, our days are fulfilled, for our end is come. Our pursuers were swifter than the eagles of the skies. They chased us upon the mountains. They laid wait for us in the wilderness. The breath of our nostrils, the anointed of Yahweh, was taken in their pits, of whom we said, Under his shadow we shall live among the nations. Rejoice and be glad, O daughter of Adom, that dwellest in the land of Oth. 
the cup shall pass through to thee also. Thou shalt be drunken, and shalt make thyself naked. The punishment of thy iniquity is accomplished, O daughter of Theon. He will no more carry thee away into captivity. He will visit thy iniquity, O daughter of Adorm. He will uncover thy sins.